here at the title screen. I'm going to go ahead and start a new game. Now this is a fresh file, so it's not going to have all my new game plus stuff. It'll be just the same as anybody starting out from the beginning. Uh, let's take a look at the settings. All right, skits. We'll go over those some more later. Uh, they're just, as it implies here, something that adds a little bit of side conversations, that sort of thing. I guess some of the titles might be spoilers or something. I'm not sure why you would turn them off, but I'm just going to leave them on. Battle controls. This is how you will interact with the current player-controlled character in the party. I seem to recall that I prefer manual, but do whatever feels good to you. You know, you can change this in-game, so feel free to try the different ones until you find which one you like best. Uh, and vibration, sure, why not? Once upon a time, there existed a giant tree that was the source of mana. A war, however, caused this tree to wither away, and a hero's life was sacrificed in order to take its place. Grieving over the loss, the goddess disappeared unto the heavens. The goddess left the angels with this edict. You must wake me, for if I should sleep, the world shall be destroyed. The angels bore the Chosen One, who headed towards the tower that reached up unto the heavens. And that marked the beginning of the regeneration. Lloyd Irving, wake up! Lloyd! Ah! How do you manage to sleep standing? Oh, Professor Rain, it, is class over? <sighs> Never mind. Let's have someone else answer the question. Genus, how about you? Yes, Rain. Mythos the hero brought about the end of the ancient war in the holy ground of Carlon. Correct. Afterwards, Mythos the hero formed a pact with the goddess Martell to seal away the Desions whom caused the war. But the Desions came back and are now causing everyone to suffer. We covered that in class last time, remember? When the seal weakens, the designs reappear, just like they have now. I... Uh, yeah, I knew that. I, I just forgot. Today is the day of prophecy. It is a very important day, which the Chosen of Mana will receive an oracle from the goddess Martell. Now, Chosen One. Yes, ma'am? Tell us about the journey of world regeneration. It is a journey to seal the designs. Upon passing the trials of the goddess Martell, the summoned spirits that protect the world awaken, and mana is restored. Correct. I suppose we should expect the Chosen herself to know the answer to that one. Mana depletion is the cause of the current food shortages and droughts. It is said that this occurs because the Desions consume vast amounts of mana in their human ranches. The Chosen's journey has two purposes, to revive mana, as well as defeat the designs. Now, for the next question. Uh, what was that? That's... Settle down. It would seem that the time for the Oracle has come. I will go and check on the chapel. Everyone stay here and study on your own. Understood? Professor! I'll go with you! No, Colette. If it is the Oracle, the priests will come here for you. Wait here with everyone else. 
Yes, ma'am. Okay, you got all that? Plenty of exposition to start with. Uh, here's our protagonist, Lloyd. And you can probably tell which characters are important here. They look a little different. Actually have voices and names. A genus. During class, Rain said that when the oracle comes, the Crucius crystal enshrined in the altar shines. So that light must have been emitted by the Crucius crystal at the temple. And we have Colette, the chosen one. That light was so pretty. She's... Yeah, you'll see. Lloyd, where are you going? Don't tell me you're sneaking out. Rain will get mad. I'm really curious to find out what really happens to Colette when she receives the Oracle. They always talk about the Chosen of Regeneration and the Day of Prophecy, but no one tells us what really happens. But my sister said to stay and study by ourselves. Okay, so... This is something that, uh... Or a good time to bring up the affection system. It keeps track of a a number for all of the party members, how rating how much they like Lloyd. And it comes up in a few scenes later in the game. Uh, usually it's like the top three, or maybe the top one for certain things. And it's important for earning certain titles. I'll get to titles in a bit. It's probably easiest just to play through your first time, not caring about it. Um, just pay attention to who receives the titles at certain events. And then on subsequent playthroughs, in, you want to manipulate things in order to make sure that different characters receive at that time. And there are specific numbers about what each response gives pluses and minuses throughout the text guide. I'm just going to play this as a first time through, just role play, not worry about the affection too much. It's research. That's just an excuse. So, an excuse is an excuse, right? Don't be so stuffy. You're coming too, right? We're best friends, after all. Colette, want to come along too? Huh? Um, okay. So where to? Where else? That light! You're directly involved in all of this. Aren't you curious? Hmm, are you curious about it? Of course. Okay. Then I'll be curious about it, too. That exchange always seemed weird to me. I talked to Sarah about it, and she said it makes more sense in context of Japanese culture. Anyway. See? Dwarven vow number four. Don't depend on others. Walk on your own two legs. Okay, then. Let's go to the temple. Eh. Not the Dwarven Vows again. You always use those when you need an excuse. Yay! My first party members. And talking about how to trigger the skits when they show up. First one should be... Any second? I don't know. It'll come. Let us look at this hole. When did this hole get here? Have you forgotten, Lloyd? This happened when Colette... It was during last year's spring cleaning. I was mopping and then accidentally... You're such a klutz, Colette. And our first title. Oh, there's the skit. I wonder if Rain is going to be mad at us. Don't worry, all we have to do is get back to class before she does. But wasn't Professor Rain going to the temple, too? What if we run into her? Uh, <laughs> we'll be fine. Probably. Alright, so titles. 
and we'll look at some other stuff too while we're here. Everybody starts with a title. Lloyd has Swordsman, Fledgling Chosen, we got Magic User. You have one equipped at a time, and they'll all earn a lot of them. You'll see down below there's a description, and then it says Level Up, and a bunch of stats that are all grayed out. But this one has HP, Strength, and Accuracy all in green, which means if she levels up with this title equipped, those stats will gain a boost. So, even if those aren't the stats that you want to raise her on, it's better than nothing. So we'll equip that for now. Oh, right. I was also going to look at strats. This is how the characters will perform when the AI controls them. Go ahead and set this up now. I like to save a little bit of TP tech points and put him in the front lines. Same here and yeah, move freely. She tends to go all over as needed. Uh, I want him to retain some more because uh, he'll want his spells ready for boss battles and long-range magic. Obviously, you'll set those up however suits you and your play style. Uh, we can look at our various options here. There's the fastest me message speed. Uh, this is not the first time I've done this episode. Uh, the first time I ran out and got killed repeatedly in the first couple fights in the game, only to realize that I had forgotten to change the battle rank here, it's the difficulty, and it was on Manic, the hardest mode that doesn't even show up here. I guess it was left over from my old... Uh, it it, it st stayed on Manic from my older playthrough. So now that it's on Normal, should be a... Uh, well, an easier time. <laughs> and you can change all this. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm going to stick with English for now. I know some people would prefer the Japanese, but... There is a reason. Okay, let's head on out. What's going on? It's awfully quiet. Where's... <clears throat> Where did everybody go? Colette! Father! Frank! Thank goodness you're safe. Frank, what happened to everyone in the village? They're all hiding. The Desions invaded the village just a short while ago. Thankfully, no one was hurt. They passed through the village and headed for the temple. Why? Isalia has a non-aggression treaty with the Desions. You mean that agreement where they don't attack the village as long as we leave the human ranch alone? Yes, Grandmother said it's to protect me. Oh, where's Grandmother? Phaedra is in the temple, preparing for the ritual. Phaedra is in the temple? But that's for the designs. The priests are there with her. There's no need to worry. Now, Colette. I know. I promise to fulfill my duty as the Chosen. Good luck, Colette. Lloyd, Genus, you two should go on home. I'm worried about letting Colette go by herself. I'll go with her to the temple. Me too. But... All right. Thank you. I'll wait at the house. Come back immediately if anything happens. In other words, he's gonna go hide, but he provides us with free infinite healing for a while, so... That's useful. Okay. We can run around. Following my guide, I go south here. 
And in here, we got our first shop. May as well use some of our starting funds. I'm gonna pick up some magic lenses and two pairs of boots. And Lloyd is our frontliner, so we're gonna protect him by having him somehow wear two pairs of boots at once. Those magic lenses, by the way, are your way of using identify. Uh, we'll be getting a vestiary, uh, the part of the codex, a little later, and using these on monsters will fill in some of the info. There's another character later that can use them more effectively, like you get more information, but there are also some enemies, or at least one, that appears only before her, so we'll want some for now. Here's our memory circle, aka the save point. And we're going to take care of that. And yes, okay. Um, I think we're ready for our first battle. Whoa, it's a monster! I thought the northern region where the temple is located was a sanctuary. Why are there... It must be part of the trial. Martel's trial involves battling monsters. We don't have time to talk. Let's get this thing. Roger. All right. Let's go all out. All right. And on normal difficulty, at least these first couple of fights are actually uh, fairly easy, so you can just kind of go berserk. I was actually trying to get a combo, but I'm still getting used to the controls. Or reused, I should say. That was easy! Lloyd, you're amazing! Oh, well, I owe it to this thing, though. Ah, that's right, the X-Sphere. Yeah! It's designed for combat and brings out my maximum strength. Without this thing, I'd be nothing. But you're still strong, Lloyd. I mean, he just said he's not, but okay. Yeah, at least his sword skills are good. What do you mean, at least? There's another one. Let's go, you two. Wait, Lloyd. The professor said magic is more effective than physical attacks against non-physical and spiritual monsters. Really? Yes! Okay then, I'll leave the ghost to Genus. I'll go for the zombie! And I can... switch my target with that. Okay, here we go! Okay! Alright, so I'll switch to the zombie! It's important to choose the target wisely when there's a lot of monsters or if we're up against a dangerous one. It's especially important when saving an ally that's in trouble. We have to be careful. Let's go to the temple. Yeah! Okay. All that. Uh, might as well... Here is Frank. Are you all right? Here, let me heal you. Useful that. And... Save. Okay. Uh, what's the temple like? So Colette, what's it like inside the temple? We've never been inside, so it's kind of exciting. Hmm, well, it's sort of dark because not much sunlight makes it through. That's not quite what I was expecting. But then again, I've never been to the inner part either. Hmm, I can't wait to get inside! 
If only you could keep up this enthusiasm the entire time. Alright, so the first boss is waiting for us at the next area. You can pretty easily defeat him at level 1, but might as well grind a little bit. That's what JRPG, JRPGs are for. And, uh, see, it's kind of like a 3D version of Adventures of Link. We have the monsters wandering around on the outside. These big ones here tend to be a little tougher. And then these little ones here are the easy fights. You just walk into them, fight starts. You're going down! Not having trouble remembering right. how the combo system works here. Let's try this again. According to my guide, I want to go Let's attack go. and forward, regular attack, right attack Get down. Out. It didn't work so well. Justice and love will always win. Oh, I hate that scene. Okay. Here comes more of them. Demon Just as I expected. Okay, I'm trying to earn a title here with a basic combo. According to the walkthrough, I want to do... We can do it! Ah. <laughs> These controls seem... I don't know. It's just slower than expected. Okay, so Lloyd's pretty hurt. Let's run back real quick. Nope. I seem to recall that normally those enemies won't be running away from you, but... It wants to be easy in the beginning, right? Okay... Also, you might have noticed that I dropped some chicken and egg. I got some bread. This is all for the cooking system. It's for healing up. I mean, mostly healing. But you have to cook everything for certain titles. We'll get into it more later when the game gives us a tutorial on it. Somebody level up. I think that was. Yeah. You're going down. Okay. Well, you know what? We'll be getting another character. And we might as well include him in the... For instance, anyway. Okay. 
people are hurt again. I could cook, but I want to save my stuff. Let's do one last trip back to Frank. And then we'll beeline it to the temple. Fight a boss and continue on. I mean, be warned, there's a lot of grinding if you're trying to complete this game. I'll probably end up... Uh, Either doing it off screen or doing fast forward or something for the particularly long, heavy ones. Okay. Whoa, that light it really is coming from the temple. Then an oracle is going to be conveyed. Colette's going to be the chosen of regeneration. It's really, really bright. Say Colette, when the oracle is conveyed, you'll become the chosen who will save the world, right? You're going to be like the hero mythos. So maybe you should act a little more, you know, chosen-like? Yeah, no problem. No problem. Hey, there's a lot of commotion at the temple. You're right. Chosen one. Pastor? Hey, are you alright? The Desions broke the non-aggression treaty and attacked the temple. Chosen one, quickly. The Oracle. I know. Please be careful. I regret that I will not be able to protect the... Chosen. Pastor, hang on! It's no good. He's gone. No! I'm going. Colette, there are designs in there. Yes, but I have to go. I'm the Chosen. My job is to accept the Oracle on the Day of Prophecy. The two of you wait here, okay? Lloyd, are you going to let Colette go by herself? I mean, funny as that is. I'm going too. I can't let you go by yourself. Are you sure? It's dangerous. Dwarven vow number one. Let's all work together for a peaceful world. Let's go. Wait, I'm going too. I'm worried about rain. Thanks, both of you. Where is the Chosen? Run, Colette! Lord Boda, there she is! Chosen One, your life is mine. I won't let you Desions get away with anything! Desions? <laughs> What's so funny? Well then, die at the hands of the designs you so hate. Get them. Let's get this over with. No way! Fireball! 
Wrong button. Still can't get that combo to work. Do not get in our way. This guy's strong. Man, this guy is really tough. Who are you? Get out of the way. How? It's probably a matter of timing here that I just am not remembering. There. Can't believe I lost to a bunch of kids. You picked the wrong guy to mess with. Huh. Well, that's useful. I never thought you'd show up. Damn! Retreat for now. Amazing. This guy's incredibly strong. Yeah, I, I suppose so. Is everyone all right? Hmm. This guy is the reason why I leave it on English. Because that is the voice of Cam Clark, a.k.a. Leonardo from the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon that I grew up with. So, he's kind of a badass. Is that an X-Fear? How can I ever thank you for saving the Chosen? I see. So this girl is the next Chosen. That's right. I have to go accept the Oracle. Grandmother, I'm going to undergo the trial now. What trial? Monsters, I assume. An evil presence radiates from inside this chapel. Yes, that is correct. The Chosen is to receive judgment from heaven. But the priests that were to accompany her fell at the hands of the Desires. Then I'll take on the job of protecting Colette. Lloyd, I would be uneasy with just you. Your name is Lloyd? Yeah, but who are you to ask for my name? I am Kratos, a mercenary. As long as you can pay me, I'll accept the job of guarding the Chosen. Under the circumstances, I have little choice. Please be of service. It's a deal, then. Wait, I'm going too. Lloyd, you'll only get in the way. Be a good boy and wait here. What did you say? Did I not make myself clear? You're a bird. Go home. Um, Mr. Kratos? Would it be okay to take Lloyd along too? But... Please. I get nervous when Lloyd's not around. Do as you wish. Let's go, Genus. What? I'm going too? Of course. This isn't a field trip, you know. Uh, yeah, but magic. Thanks, Colette. 
It's the truth. So this is what the inside of the temple is like. Colette, you've been in here many times, right? Yeah, but it's di seems different than usual. I sense the presence of monsters. Don't let your guard down. We can handle a few measly monsters. Let's go. Wait. Lloyd, are your sword techniques self-taught? Yeah, that's right. What is this thing? If you are going to use a sword, then at least learn the basics. You want to protect the Chosen, don't you? Hmph. <laughs> you think you know so much? Okay, we're gonna not do this first dungeon quite yet. Oh, and by the way, during that boss fight, I noticed that Genus learned a spell. I don't remember what causes that, so I should probably look that up. For now, I'm going to go ahead and save. And we'll call it good for this episode. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you for the next one, where we'll be trying to earn some titles. And then, if we do that in time, going into the dungeon. Thank you, and see you later.